So, um, in an attempt to save cost, to save time, and to save labor, uh, we find out that some farmers uh, mix pesticide, herbicide, nematicide, they mix everything together in their knapsack and they want to apply so that they want to apply insecticide together with herbicide so that they will not be paying for labor two times so that uh, it will save them time to save them cost now this is a very very bad practice and most often times it's backfired and when it's backfired the result is very very horrible it will be very very horrible there are some certain chemicals that are never meant to be mixed together. If you mix together, uh, the result could be the burning of your crop. And most times, the result, as in the efficient efficiency of each of the chemical you mix together will be reduced, which will lead uh, into a kind of poor performance. And at the end of the day, the, you will not be getting the result of what you should get if you have applied each of them at separate time. Now, the essence of me making this video is to let you know that often time, what you are trying to what you are trying to avoid, the cost you are trying to cut, you will end up spending more, or you end up losing more than that if you mix like two or three chemicals together. Though there are some few chemicals you can mix together, but there are numerous ones you should never mix together because their combination will, will result into interrelation and ampering their activity, which will result into poor performance. For example, if you are mixing glyphosate and 2,4-D, it will harm your crop. It will harm your crop. Most likely, it will burn your crop. Now, also, if you are applying a chemical like atrazine and 2,4-D, together the result you'll be getting is reduced performance so uh, i just thought of making this video so as to encourage our farmer uh, to avoid this kind of thing and always to read label if you can combine the producer will make it uh, will make it known on the label and it the producer will name the type of chemical you can combine with this and the producer will all, all also in most cases tell you the kind of chemical you should not compare, you should not combine together with this kind of chemical. The results are always, most times, horrible. You lose your crop, or you harm your crop, or you will not be getting the desired result. So with this, I've come to the end of today's uh, topic. It's just a short uh, information content. Thank you for your time, and see you on the next one. I remember my humble self, Lawa Olushalalawa. Sheshe.